Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Mega Man Collection. Last time we took out Woodman, uh, yeah, I kind of boxed it up, wasting Heat Man's power like that, and had to use an E-Tank, and still that was almost not enough. Well, <laughs> thankfully it was. So, we're going to take on uh, another more challenging stage. Uh, we're going to take on Crash Rant next. Uh, Crash Man, definitely one of the hardest uh, villains to beat, Robot Master-wise. Unless you know a little, uh, you understand his fight mechanic. So, as to start, you see these little pipes, they spout those little spinning guys that like to chase you around. Not, not good. So we'll just go around this way. You. Let's climb up. No, nope, that didn't work out as intended. That's okay. Definitely want to have the number one equipped for this. Well, if it works. There we go. If you're quick enough, you can actually avoid getting hit. But of course, when I actually record, I actually mess up. That's alright. A yeah, pretty strange layout for this stage. Uh, it's like a lot of pipes intertwining and so forth. That's what I was saying last time about moving platforms. <laughs> uh, a lot of times they have these little guys floating around, chasing you on the platforms. Have Woodman's power equipped. As long as you don't move, you'll keep the shield on indefinitely. So, just do that to get around the platform. Or you can use the number one and quickly scale up to get up there. Which I'm gonna do for the next couple of screens, because there's like three of these. And, and I'll just save some time. Just like that. Alright. Continue on. Yeah, this stage is a lot of climbing. We're going up, up, up. Alright, this jump is a little tricky. Nice. Yeah, kind of just do what I did. You jump to, to the middle platform, shoot as you land, and quickly jump back. And you should be able to avoid the, the shot. Or you can use number one and avoid the risk of getting shot and falling back down. So let's get Woodman power equipped for this next part. So we're going to be doing some more climbing. Yeah, that takes care of that. Holy crap! I don't think that's ever happened before! Nothing but one-ups? How many of those did I actually capture? I'll have to take a look. Wait until I get to the top here. And I know it was very brief, but you guys saw that too, right? I was like I grabbed like two or three lives. Oh. Wow! <laughs> See something new every day, even, you know, many, many years after playing it. Climb up. Definitely want to go up this way. Because there's another one up! Watch out for these guys. Wow, one. One up happy. Wow. I'm not even farming you guys. I'm just killing stuff. I was hoping to get some energy tanks, but that's alright. Wow, this game just blessed me with lives. 
though. It's okay if I die here, but I don't think we will. So here's Crash Man. Basically, if you shoot, he's going to jump up and shoot a bomb. And he'll just walk back and forth. So all you have to do is kind of like anticipate him. When he gets close, shoot him in the air. And he should be fine. Yeah, it's going to take a, a little while. I think he's lose one health point for a uh, shot. But not knowing this method, he's quite difficult because he's continually hop around and they're like, man, get off me. And, and he's no fun at all. But fortunately, I find this method pretty useful. One more hit. There we go. And that's how you deal with Crash Man. And I don't think I got hit, did I? No. See? And I got all those extra lives, so... We should be good for the rest of the game. Wow, that's just amazing just to see how many one-ups were popping on the screen. So. Alright. If we got five Robot Masters down, we have three left. Who are we going to go with next? Find out next time. Take care, everyone.